Hey, what's up everyone? My name is Cap'n. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to Paradise. Brand new game that's actually coming out on Thursday. You can download the demo now if you want to. Um, actually, I have a link in the video description down below. It'll take you to the Steam page. You can download the demo and play it. Or if you wanted to go ahead and wishlist it or get the game, it's 15% off right now. Big shout out to the devs for sponsoring this video. Truly do appreciate them allowing me to play it early and to show you guys what this game is. So what is it? It's kind of an arcadey action RPG with survival and crafting elements. Basically, you're in a zombie apocalypse, but it's a lot more fun in the fact that you can take over zombies. You can take control of them, capture them, make them your workers to do your bidding, teach them how to farm, teach them how to fight, they gather the stuff, they'll defend your camp while you're exploring and you're looking for a new paradise. This game is going to be coming out on PC, PlayStation 5, and Xbox. So, if you want to go check it out, the link's in the video description down below. But, let's just get into the game so you guys can see what it actually looks like. So, let's go through the intro. Are you tired of constantly fleeing? Of hiding? Of struggling in a world infested by zombies? Are you exhausted? Without resources? A home? Without anyone to rely on? Don't despair. Hang in there. You still have a chance. Join us. Join Paradise! Here in Paradise, everyone is safe and everything is secure thanks to our Zombie Guard technology. It's a haven of peace where zombies are under our control. Here, zombies no longer attack you, they defend you. Yes, you heard that right. It's incredible. Thanks to our Zombie Guard technology, Zombies have become genuine bodyguards that serve you. Thousands of acres where the living are back in control and existing in harmony, far from the pandemic, thanks to this groundbreaking technology. Stores, security guards, hospitals, industry, movie theaters. A safe place for everyone, where men, women, and children have nothing more to fear from outside zombies you don't need money, a title, or diploma to get your own zombie guard. Everyone is welcome in paradise. Everyone is welcome in par- Everyone is welcome. Everyone is welcome. So we've made it to paradise. We traveled across the world, defeating zombies along the way. When, look, some free wood. Free wood's always good. I'm guessing this is my way to attack. That looks horrible. That looks horrible. You can see on the game right now, it's got a, an option for player two to push to join. It's two player local co-op or four players online. That you can play collect, uh, cooperatively with your friends. So what do we have here? Oh, please tell me I can't fall off this bridge. Let's have a look and see what's going on. That looks like a pretty good way to keep the zombies out. Much props to the base designers of this game. Although this bridge doesn't really look very stable. And I'm thinking like, I don't know, one pulley and a rope could turn this into a drawbridge and, you know, minimize ways to get across over here. I feel like that could be a problem. All right, well, let's go inside and see what's going on. Cross the pit and enter the park. All right, we did that. Uh, speak with the warden. Okay. Uh, oh, cool. Look. The zombies are over here. Well, look at them gathering. What are y'all? Are y'all gathering wood? Look at that. Who doesn't want their own zombie assistance? This kind of like the end of Shaun of the Dead when they realize that the zombies kind of return to their original, you know, muscle memory. And so they like put them to work. Here, I'll help you. I'll pick up some wood. All right. So let's see. It's kind of a, it's not a third person. It's kind of like a top down almost. It has a little bit of like a project zomboid look to it. What do we have here? 
Welcome to paradise. Okay, so that is not what these zombies look like down here, is it? No, they do not look like... Okay, so your mask doesn't look as cool as advertised. I need to talk to the warden about that. Hey, warden. What's up? Ah, I could watch them all day. Don't even need to fetch wood. They feed the generator all by themselves. No nice. No worrying about electricity. Maybe I could teach them to cultivate my veggies. See, that's the way you do it. Oh, oh sorry. Didn't see you there. Oh, you didn't see me Are there. Are you huh? wanting to move in here? I want to own this place. This is mine now. Uh, wait. Uh, hold up. What am I supposed to do? No one ever wants to move in here. Uh, uh, yes, the bylaws. Bylaws. Yes, that's it. Rule number one of the Paradise Bylaws. To gain authorization to move then in, you must have you a zombot. Must have a zombot. No one should move no around should paradise without move zombot protection. In paradise without zombot protection. Okay, how do I get a zombot? So before anything else, find a zombot. Go see Bob. He supplied mine. Wait, hold on. So you're the warden in charge of this place. You're giving me a task to do, but you didn't even do it yourself. Rude. M to open the map. Okay, all right, so there's Bob's. Don't die, find Bob. I can do that. Let me see, it's going to be that direction, compass up in the right-hand corner. Cool! All right, well, I, I'm really looking forward to this game. I've had an eye on this game for a little while. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. It's different. It's a little bit silly, you know. It's it's not, doesn't take itself so serious. What is what is this? Um. Okay. I don't know what that is. Hold shift to run. Okay, so we're in a tutorial phase here. Use the click button to attack zombies. Well, we can do that. Let's see. Where are some zombies to attack? Ooh, hold on. There's one. Damn. Oh, you got wrecked. I'm going to rip some cloth of you. Nice. Are you... In... Okay, so you're like a path marker. Well, we don't follow the path too often. We're going to kind of venture off the path and just wander around. Looks like we get a little bit of room to explore. It is open world, but I don't know how much is limited. So I don't know, you know, if we're going to find things, if we're not going to find things, you know, if it's going to run into a border. I have no idea. All right, so we got our health bar. We got a stamina. We got heat and cold meter down there. We got quick sections through one and five. Uh, looks like we can have a quick switch between two items. What's this? Interact. Bob's archives. Bob's archives. Emotional the support zombot. Support zombot. Emotional Open support zombie. Sweet. Pylon configuration menu. Okay. Equip your zombot with a saddle, then a saddle to heal you while in combat, and to collect items while out of combat. Okay, so out of combat, you heal items in combat and collect items out of combat. Oh, cool! How do I get a saddle? Do I get to ride and a zombie? That's it. A zombie to heal you, transport you, and collect items. Hmm? There's more to life than combat. Barely. That's cool. So I knew that you could program the zombies to work for you. That's sweet. Actually, you can give them like specific tasks. Can I do that now? Oh, I don't have that actually open. Okay, so I have a piece of ripped cloth. What can I do with that? Air pellets, bandage. I need some sage. I'm going to guess that's just laying around somewhere, and I'll probably pick up some. 50 XP. I don't even know what I did. Oh, that's a that's some zombies. Stop biting me. Turn around. Okay, good. Nice. You got some swing through. Let's do a finish you off. Holy monkey. Okay, find your cursor, find your cursor. We took a little bit of damage, but it's okay. We don't have like an infection or anything terrible going on at the moment. The fact that you can hit multiple zombies at one time is great. I like that. I like being able to have some swing through damage. We might as well go ahead and get y'all too. Oh yeah. Broken hacking helmet. Ripped cloth. Nice, ripped cloth. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Uh, let's see. Oh, there's a bunch of zombies over here. Maybe we should not attract everything. What are you? Activate. Hang on, I'm activating some. Don't attack me. Outpost, force center, unlock. Whoa! Ow! 
I got hit. So the zombies that are already... Oh, nice. Good job, you. Speak with Bob. Who's Bob? Bob? Oh, hang on. I got some leaves here. Ooh, and... Yeah, let's, let's speak to Bob. Oh, hey. You're What's up? new here, right? Ha. I'm Bob. I'm the one who got the Zombot technology back up and running. The zombie hacking. You want Zombot? What a nerd. I can't give you mine. I need them too much. So, you should capture your own. Is he using a blender Grab and a, a light bulb? a helmet from one of the malfunctioning Zombots in front of my camp. Repair it and force it onto the head of a wild zombie. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. If it stops wanting to eat you, it's worked. If not, uh, run. There you have it. 60% of the time, it works every time. All right, so I picked up a broken ha a helmet. Can I... Hacking helmet. Oh, nice. I have I already have what I have. Sweet. Hell yeah, I got one. Now I just gotta... Now I just gotta track the zombie here. Ripped cloth. Oh, hang on. Oh, so I can do it to one who's already already whooped their ass. Okay, cool. Get up. Nice. Look at you bringing me some sage. Sweet. I need to. I want to know. Can I name you? Hold on. Crafting. Let's see. I don't have access to those yet. Skills. Oh, I got two skill points. What are you? Okay, I guess I'm using one there. What does that one do here? Allow you to revive your KO'd zombies, revive zombies in a dead. Yep. Mm, replace your dead zombies with each fast travel and heal ones that are still with you. Oh, that could be useful. 20% attack speed in the saddle. I don't have a saddle. I'm not worry about that one yet. Zombots run away, regenerate their health more quickly, flee to fight another day. Increase the amount of scraps recovered by your zombots. That could be useful. Actually, let's do that one. I feel like that one could be quite, a, quite useful. Let's talk to Bob again and see what he's got for us. Well, 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 not bad, right? This zombot will follow you everywhere, but if you want to give it precise orders, you'll need to use the tech I developed. Of course. You'll be my guinea pig. Take this antenna, attach it to your backpack. Okay. With this, you'll have much finer control over your zombot. Oh, feel free to give it a try. Okay. Zombie hacking was quite buggy until we started working on it, uh, me and my buddies. I know what I'm doing. I trust, trust you. you. This thing probably won't explode. That's good enough odds for me. Okay, hover over target and with mouse and order Zombot to attack. Oh, okay, so I can just tell you to do your thing. All right, come with me. Let's see this here. Let, how about you go attack her? Do it. Whoops a may. No, did you just one punch her? Well done. Oh, hey, what's what are you? Hang on, no, here. Oh, dude, you just kicked the farmer's butt too. Ooh, got another chest over here. Let's see what this is. Oh, no, the bombs are coming. Okay. Social distancing zombot. Open the portable pylon configuration menu. Okay. Equip your Zombot with spiked armor and a bat, and order it to use this to provoke enemies while in combat. Okay. And then, let me guess, I'm gonna combat, and then maybe a taunt out of combat? And that is it. First, oh, okay, spikes, in combat, and taunt, and then use them. Nice! The enemy shouldn't get any closer, but if provoked, they won't be able to help themselves. Totally. Cool. All right. So across the bridge downtown, I can't do anything. Craft bandages. Oh, so you're just kind of walking me through the. I'll go ahead and craft ones while I have it. I'm probably gonna need it pretty soon. Talk to the warden. Okay. Let me see. This thing that I activated over here is this like a fast travel? Oh, it is. Nice. It's a poop shoot. Ploop. Fantastic. Oh, the <laughs> zombie fell out and splatted. That is fan freaking tastic. Invasion. Talk to the warden. Okay. Oh no! Wild zombies have got uh -oh. in. Uh oh. They, they, they. Ah, Here. Not again. What do we gotta do? 
What do we, just kill everything? What do we do? What do we do? What are we gonna do? Eliminate the- Oh, we just gotta kill them all. Kill them all, baby! Oh, this stick is pretty beast. If there's better weapons than this, I don't know if I'm gonna need them. I mean, I'm just beating some ass with a stick I found on the side of the road. Uh, use your flashlight? Is that, what does that do? At night, zombies become stronger. Use it to blind them? Beat my generator with mood. My zombies are down. With wood? The gate won't close without electricity. Do I have any wood, as you put it? Uh, wood. There's some wood. Uh, sure, I'll stick all of it in there for the now. Button. Where's the button? Close button. The gate. Where's the button? Let any other wild zombies. Call me crazy, but I feel like it would be better if the gate stayed closed and you had to push the button to open it. That that seems like it would make more sense. Again, what was I saying earlier? How it would be better if you you know could pull the drawbridge up instead of just leaving it wide open. Kind of seems like a faulty system here. I don't know where your other buddies went here, but uh, you, you're going to be fetching wood all by yourself. All right, well, let's see what the warden has to say. Oh, one less. Well, that'll teach me to forget to close the gate. Thankfully, the pit keeps most wild zombies out of paradise. Yeah, most of them. And you found a zombot? Yeah, I did. Great. I know. Here are the plans for building your camp. You need to go to the other side of the river. What? To the wild forest. Why? Be careful out there. There's no one left there, and the Zombots are out of control. You'd better find yourself a weapon. Don't look at me like that. I can't do the cleaning as well as watch the gate. You're not watching the gate. Go see the circus sharpshooter who has settled in the area. Okay, but you, you're you not... Oh, hang on, I have an idea. How many more... How many of these can I... I can make seven of those. Here, how about we'll make two? I'm not sure if I made two or if I have three now. I have three. Okay, cool. All right. Well, can I wake any of these idiots up or are they kind of not fair game? Is it kind of outside the gate? All right. Where am I going to find Pedro? So I need to navigate around over here. What is this thing? I wonder. That is an entry point into what? Oh, that's a pretty big world. Well, that is, that's, there's a lot to this. Nice. I like that. All right, we'll see if we can go over and find Pedro. See if he can't teach us how to become a sharpshooter, right? Maybe we can catch ourselves. Well, I might as well grab some more sage. See if we can tackle a couple more zombies along the way and see if we can't make them work for us. Oh, hang on. Since I have the zombots now, so I have you. Let's see, in combat, you'll use a um, piece of wood. And zombie target. Att attract enemy fire. Look at your foes. Really want a high score. Sure. Wait, can I not put you on there? Or do I maybe have to... How did I find a zombie target? Oh, I can change their outfits too. Oh, that was... Yep. Yeah. First dude's totally getting Christmas jammies and snowflake. Yeah. I'm sorry, dude. I have to, you know, not only get you to work for me against your will, but you're also going to look like a moron while you're doing it. <laughs> Goosesses! Holy hell. Here, beat on this zombie right there. That it, huh? Zombie target. Okay, so that's it. 50%. Maybe you have to find a certain number of them, and then it'll allow you to use it. I need to go down south a little bit further. It does appear you can use a controller in this game, too, should you so desire it. Oh, I still need to go down. So if you're one of those people that wants that doesn't really like using keyboard and mouse that well, or it's just not your bag, well, you can use a uh, controller in this. I'm using keyboard and mouse, so I cannot say how well it does or doesn't work. All right, yeah, so that's kind of what it seems like, is that after I pick one up, it gave me a percentage. So maybe when it gets to, a, ooh, 100% a zombie saddle. Nice. So I need to get, uh, let me see, I need to get this. Use V to open the zombie hacking menu and equip your zombots with the gear you've recovered. 
Zombie hack. Okay, so this, and I can equip you. Nice. And what does that do? Attracts enemy fire. Looks like, oh, cool. So if somebody's shooting at me, that works. You can set them free. Yeah, we're not doing that. Hey, uh oh, let's get a drink. I don't see any form of hydration anywhere. Okay, so can I? I, d I want to double check. I did make myself a hacking helmet, right? I did. I wonder if maybe I can only have one at a time in, in, uh, here, you fight them. Good job. I wonder if you can only have one at a time when it comes to, uh, zombies until you get like a skill point up or something. Cause I have the helmets. Hey dude, you're kind of late to the party here. I mean, I guess I'll do everything, but still. I kind of want to use one of these other... Maybe zombies that already have the helmet on there I can't use. Maybe, maybe? Are you Pedro? Speak to Pedro. How did you manage to make it here? I'm pretty awesome. You're looking for a weapon? Yep. Good timing. My uh, zombots have started attacking everything that moves, including me. I need someone to... Teach them some manners. Oh, I'm all I'll over let that. You take their weapons if you finish them off. Look, can I have? You need me to kill the zombies. You just okay? So they have weapons and I don't. Oh hell! All right, well let's just go to town. Oh yeah. Beat some A. Right, sounds like somebody's got a gun. Okay, so you do have a little bit more health. It's not terrible. Come here, you. Stop trying to shoot me. Did my zombie die? I'm gonna finish you off. Dirty rotten undead. Destroy the pylon, kiddo. I'm done with that. Ooh, brain air pistol. Newfangled technology. What? Pylon. Hold on, where's the pile? Oh, pylon's over here. Uh, I'll at least activate this one. Maybe oh yeah, it's the fast travel thing. I definitely gotta do that. Ta-da! Is this a pylon? Kinda seems like a pylon. Oh, hang on. Uh let's use this. Let's see what this does. Oh dude, it's just launching zombies out of it. I gotta beat this thing down before it. <laughs> I'm guessing my zombie's dead. Hang on, we gotta get rid of the pylon here. Couple more good hits and it's done for. If you stand in the way, you're gonna get hit too. Nice. Use V to open the zombie hacking menu and equip your zombots in the weapons they found once your inventory weapon becomes available. Okay. Well, I, my zombot is currently dead, so you're gonna have to just work with me for a second here. Okay, so these zombies have a little bit more life. And they hit a little bit harder than the other one. So maybe a stick isn't the best option. I mean, it's working for the moment. Let's finish you off here. No. I'm going to capture you and make you mine. You've replaced the other idiot. Okay, are we done here? All right, so I could give you common air. Look what you've made with some trash, a bottle, and some tape. Sure, now you can shoot back. Yeah, you better shoot back really good, okay? Hold on, we gotta go check out Bob's doohickey. Bob's archives, the high score zombot, sweet. The high score zombot. Open the portable pylon configuration menu. Okay. Equip your zombot with a zombie target. Did it. And an air pistol. Right on it. Then order it to use its weapon while in combat. Okay. And that's it. That's now it, huh? The zombies try to hit the bullseye. It's your zombot who's striping them. Sweet. Yeah, look at him holding it all gangster style. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's fantastic. That's just fantastic. 
Okay, well, let me make sure I actually have you set to use. And then out of combat, yeah, you can collect. That'll work. So use your pistol. Yeah, baby. Fantastic. Speak with Pedro. I think we cleaned up your area nicely. Let me gather all the stuff that's remained from whooping all these zombies' butts here. Well, maybe I missed something. What's up, Pedro? I got your stuff fixed for you. Thank you, kiddo. You're welcome. Oh, I didn't have enough bullets to finish him off, but otherwise I most <laughs> certainly would have. This cataract won't stop me hitting the bullseye. Anyway, uh, can I sign you an autograph for your trouble? What? Um, You've never heard of me? No, nope, sorry, I'm kind of new I'm here. I'm the most famous, the most celebrated, and the sharpest of all sharp shooters in what? the history of circus, kiddo. I'm Pedro the Great. Because I like you, uh, here's a little tip from Uncle Pedro. Zombies start to swarm when you try to run away. It's best to take them out right away. If you run, you're as good as done. Okay. A quick punch, and you won't be lunch. Now, if you make it rhyme, I'll probably remember it better. Repair a bridge. New recipe unlocked. Rope and a plank. Sweet. You know what I probably should use real quick is one of my bandages. I made some bandages, didn't I? Where where would I have put my bandages? Where did they go? Oh, they're in my inventory. Okay, so one. There we go. I should probably make a couple more just in case. Let's see. That would be here. I can make... Yeah, tell you what, we'll make all seven of those. And then we'll use another one. Kind of get those back up. So it doesn't really look... Oh, okay. I see the my one zombie down there. Do I have another skill point? I got two skill points. Okay. Allows you to revive them. Did that. Gotta have five to get up over here. Tenacious Servant. Increases Zombot's HP that can now serve you longer. That'd probably be useful. And let's do that again here. We're gonna make some tanks. Yeah. I want, I'm want. i wondering because it kind of seems... Oh, there's three sections here. I didn't see that. Okay. Hacking, combat, and survival. So I'm wondering, because right now it kind of seems like I can only have just the one. I'm not quite sure if there's a way to do more than one or not. All right, so that's... Uh, uh, good job. You did, you, get, you did good protecting me. One of the bridges we got to repair is right over here, so let's go do that. Here, I'll help. You get that guy. Teamwork! All right, so... E to repair. I need three planks and two pieces of rope. There's a lot going on over there. Can you attack them from here? Shoot him. You have a you have a literal gun. All right. So crafting. We need to make three planks. So let me see. We'll do just exactly as many as we need. Craft and two pieces of rope. And repair. Confirm. Let's see how long. It, oh hell! There we go. Oh, these guys got spikes. Here, fight them for me. You missed. You need to work on your aim, sir. Try again. There you go. Uh, nice shooting. Sweet. Some spiky armor? Oh, I got a bat. Yeah. Okay, screw working on a stick. We need to... I need to equip you. Can I put you down right here? There we go. Now, I don't know. I have no ammo for this gun. The reason why. To craft ammunition, open. So I need to craft ammo. Common air pistol, common air pistol. Isn't there a scrap button? Scrap junk. Let me see what that does. Okay, cool. That scrapped all the extra crap I don't necessarily need. Air pistol pellets. Okay, so I can craft 50. Nice. Okay. Oh, dang, I got hit hard from those guys. Use a couple bandages here. Let me use another one and get that up a little bit. Okay, all right, so I have a little bit of range damage now. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was way better than beating them on him with a bat. Here, you go after this guy. I'm going to shoot the pylon. Hit him. Hit him. What are you doing? Here, I'll help out. Okay, we gotta get rid of the pylon. Hang on, gotta reload. Nice! 
That's so much faster. Home sweet home part two. Gather resources from pylons, metal two, metal plates, and nails. Make some planks. So we got a we got a lot more things to have to do. Just one shot in these guys. With range too? Here, I'll get this one, you get the other one. You seem to be having some difficulty with your aiming here. I'm not sure if it's a zombie thing or a skill thing. I'm not quite sure, but you need to figure it out, dude. Here, you get this one. Try that one. There you go. Although, I think you just shot Sylvia, and I'm, if that's the case, I don't appreciate that. That looked like a nurse zombie to me. Oh, now you shoot at him. Now that I already killed him. All right, so we have another bridge over here to repair. Let's just see if we can snipe some of these idiots. Why can I not hit you from here? Seriously? Can I not hit you from there? I was just hitting you. Huh, okay. Well, let me repair the bridge for, oh, I need more rope, okay. Repair and confirm. Ready to whoop some A? Oh, sure. You, you know, shoot him a couple times after I did most of the damage. Whatever, right? Whatever. Nice. Got an achievement for killing a hundred zombies. That is so much faster. <laughs> so much faster. I need to see if I can't get more than one. I want a, I want a full I want a full robotic army of zombies here. Do I not have See, I have a hacking helmet. There's one right there. I see it. I wonder if I can only have one right the moment. What's expert mode? Oh. Well, you can get all kinds of in-depth extra stuff over here. And I'm going to keep it on beginner mode for a moment. We'll let you do your thing, man. We'll let you do your thing. Hopefully you have enough ammo. And I got another skill point, so I'm one more away from being able to get into up over here. But what do we have over here? Combat. Increased damage taken by enemies who have not spotted you. Increase the amount of damage dealt by your ranged weapon. That could be useful. That could be useful. Cool. Well, guys, that's going to do it for this video. I'm going to stop right here. we got a long ways to go. There's a whole lot more left of this story here. If you guys want to see some more of this, definitely let me know in the comments. Leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you're not already. Make sure you go check out the, you know, click my link in the video description to go check it out if you want to wishlist it, download the demo. Again, thanks to the devs for sponsoring the video. Truly appreciate it. You guys have a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you later.